Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing well. Yet another player review. Yes, we are doing player reviews back to back because there are so many talents we are being released on this game. And many of you guys might not know about some of these players, and some of you guys are aware of these players. So for those who don't know, we are gonna be doing yet another objective player, which is gonna be Johan Mohika. He is a left back preferred position and is going to be played at left wing back and left mid if you guys want to play in him in those positions now this is an objective player like i said so you have to complete four different objectives to get this card we're going to see what those objectives are then get the card look at his stats in depth and put him in a squad at left back position and then play him and see how he is in game whether the stats are true to the card or not and all those kind of stuff whether he's overrated or whether he's underrated or whether he's good we are gonna be deciding that at the end of the video so hope you guys are ready let's get started without any further ado let's look at these objectives that you need to complete so play six matches simple just play six matches not next one win five matches while having at least three la liga players cool easy he's player from la liga you can do that and then the one which was very difficult for me is getting the clean sheet no matter what, where i played it was usually a bit hard so you guys might have to be a patient with this so achieve three uh, clean sheets while having three colombian players uh, now getting three colombian players is not hard you just got uh, a car who did we get we got the defense thing right the evolution thing so we can get one player out of that and i'm pretty sure you guys can get two more colombian players and then getting three clean sheets is the one which is going to be a little bit difficult uh, assist four goals using a defender is easy so three colombian players and uh, three la ligan players if you have sorted easy to complete i did this in around i think two hours because you just have to play five six games and uh, achieving the clean sheet was a bit of a pain but apart from that it was pretty very pretty much nothing guys so it's an easy grind now let us actually look at the card before we collect the rewards so five star skill move four star weak foot preferred foot is left player is a left back preferred positions are left back and alternate positions are left wing back and left mid so having a left footed left back is actually not bad which is really good because i don't know i feel always ha having a left footed left back and a right footed right back helps out a lot but let's look at his uh, stats now 99 pace self-explanatory insane on paper these are on paper we don't know how he's gonna be in game we will try him out in game now coming to passing he has really good crossing that is a big relief i don't care about the rest because he is a fallback good dribbling good pace and good crossing is all i see in a left back or a right back pretty much even as, as a winger i mean shooting is a bit important when it comes to wingers because i usually take shots from outside the box so i i'm happy that he doesn't have a left wing position as alternate position and he does have 96 shot but if you look under shooting he has 82 shooting but under shooting he has 92 96 shot par and under passing he has 90 curve so 96 shot par 90 curve but only 80 long shot you have to keep this in mind when you're trying to take a shot it's gonna be hell it's gonna be hell trying to get a goal from those off positions if you're gonna take a shot with them but apart from that i don't think it's a bad card you know you're getting this card for free so should we complain i don't know it's a good fodder even if we don't use him in our squads in our club for games free card good fodder 93 rated card guys. 93 rated card i am not gonna complain but looking at his defending oh defending is actually good 86 defending is low overall stats most of it comes from the heading accuracy but 88 interception uh, 92 slant tackle slide tackle is 90 maybe he is not a very defensive fallback i would say that much because he does have a decent bit of attacking uh, what do you say attacking attacking stats maybe i don't know 90 passing 90 long pass 90 curve 94 crossing 96 short par 99 pace 90 how i don't know i don't know how to feel about this 86 dribbling and this 82 shooting guys i'm having mixed emotions but even 85 stamina hmm first impression not that great of a card 
even though it's free even though i'm not complaining i don't i don't care free cards any day i'll take that to 93 rated card i'll be happy i mean look at the card look at the card dynamic and the card as it is that small the small figure in the left part of the screen it looks impressive actually you you actually glaze past the fact that he has only 82 shooting apart from that it looks okay i can play with them go and look at it in depth uh, not that great so that is how i'm feeling let us look at his play style plus his long ball plus he has intercept he has a uh, quick step plus k decent play style plus is not that much impressive play styles so it's already a mixed emotion for me let us actually put him in the squad and try how it is let us not be quick to judge let us actually use him in squad and then judge whether he's his card is actually good or not so yeah actually let us do that now look at the card he does get plus four in most of the places now you guys can look at it i'm not gonna tell it out loud because most of it is he has good dribbling guys now he has got 98 dribbling after the chemistry being added he has 94 dribbling which also looks pretty impressive right now stand tackle is improved slight tackle is improved defensive awareness is actually pretty looking pretty good and apart from that his shot power has gone to max um curve has gone to 94 now it is looking like a decent usable card you know i'm not gonna lie now it's looking like a decent usable card we will use this squad and see how it is this is the same squad that we used in yesterday's video while play using timothy Vea. now we'll use the same squad. i'll just remove vasquez and bring in athenia apart from that we'll yeah we'll just use the squad and see how it is johan mohika pace pace like i'm not complaining about pace guys it's too he is too rapid to even handle for me. Like the pace is really good. Crossing actually pretty good, you know. Crossing is actually pretty good. I'm not gonna complain about speed or crossing. It's really good. Now we've played only for four minutes in game time. Uh, it might be a bit too quick to judge, but uh, uh, first impressions, first impressions, pace and uh, what do you say? Pace and uh, crossing is looking really decent. Ooh. dribbling it's a bit weird you know like will he be able to do the same dribbling when there are players running towards him like when he has the ball and when he has to face players will he be able to have, maintain the same dribbling that is where my brain cells are telling maybe not pass long pass is also pretty decent after the chemistry boost like crossing is also improved drastically Look at that. Crossing is actually pretty good. Crossing is... Uh, I'm not going to complain about crossing. We'll just try to do crossing another time. Crossing is actually really good. And pace is really good. Hmm. Is it... Is it um, good to use him in game? Will you be able to win games? Or get... Um, what do you say? Win, able to win 1v1s with him in game? Maybe not. Maybe not. But he's a, he's a good fodder. He's a good fodder. What I have come to conclusion, just after playing with him for uh, 22 minutes of in-game time is, he might not be a great left-back first choice. He can be a good, like, what do you say, super sub. Because he does have good speed. And you get the good a player with good speed for free. So if you guys don't have a good secondary left-back as a substitute, you can use him as a secondary left back. I, that, that's where I'm going to put him. He's not a bad player. No, I'm not telling that he's a bad player. He's a good player. But certain stats. It just, it's just the game, you know. It's, it's weird. Like the players who have bad stats in game. Actually play really good in, in game. Like in, in real life. In, now I am watching the Euros, right? So yeah, it is weird to judge them just on the basis of game. So... In game, um, ball control is not great. Dribbling is decent. I'm just gonna stop playing. Uh, dribbling is decent. Ball control is a bit, you know, he just touches the ball and it takes a long touch. Pace is really good. Crossing is really good. Um, shooting, dodgy. Pass, good. Long pass, good. 
yeah i think i think overall as a package he's a fun player to use maybe for one or two games to get used to it like yohan mojica maybe maybe see look at that ball control is awful ball con he takes a weird big touch like i don't know why players who have low stats do that but it's it's a weird thing that this game is put into the thing but apart from that i wouldn't complain much free card use him as much as you can if you guys want to experiment yeah apart from that i don't know like i'm not going to say anything negative because it is what it is uh, like i don't have anything negative to say it's just uh, i wish he had better uh, ball cut. look at that touch look at that when he does when he, he does a weird ah look at that like the dribbling aspect is good right but the ball control aspect is where my I'm like, look at that. He, anybody else in his position, would control that ball from going out. But because of his one extra powerful touch, it just goes out. So that is the one thing I am like. Maybe it should be improved. But apart from that, good cut. Use him, complete him, keep him as a fodder. Fun days, fun days. But yeah, I'll see you. I just knocked the mic out. I'll see you guys in the next video. I don't know what the next video is gonna be. Hopefully, it'll be a bit. Uh, better than this one or a better card than this or a better you know a different thing not a player player review maybe we'll go back to fc mobile for some time and see how it goes so yeah i'll see you guys in the next one until then take care please do hit the like button and subscribe if you guys uh, want more let me know even if you guys don't want more if you guys enjoyed this or the previous videos on the channel check them out like them please do hit the subscribe helps out a lot I'll see you guys in the next one, guys. Take care, stay safe, stay motivated, and give my life. Bye-bye.